Okay, so two weeks ago I went on a mission and I wanted to test out whether this Nivea Radiant Beauty Care was gonna get rid of my stretch marks. Okay, it has avocado, almond, soybean, macadamia, and olive oil. Oh, I guess those are the five. So those are the five things that it has. And it says 48 hours long lasting nourishment visibly reduces the appearance of stretch marks in two weeks. Okay, so we are going to try this out. I have the ashiest legs. Okay, the ashiest, the driest. If you're looking for dry skin, I'm your girl. Okay, I am your girl. I am dry skin. I don't know what... Maybe I didn't drink enough water, I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna try and drink lots of water as well. And we can see what happens in, because it says two weeks. We're gonna look at my stretch marks. I've got stretch marks all over, but I'm gonna show you the ones on my knees, okay? Let's get down. I've brought you all the way down here. Okay, so, because we wanna make this experiment fair and we wanna see um, if there's any visible change, I'm going to leave the camera at the exact same settings when I film this after two weeks. So it'll be 3.25 the f-stop, 125 on the shutter speed, and the ISO is at 200. And the light that I have here is set all the way to 100, so that's a variable that's not going to change. But the camera settings are going to be exactly the same, and I'll try and film uh, in this area which is close to the couch. Okay, so I'm gonna show you my dry legs. I've taken a shower and I haven't put any oil on my skin or anything. So these are how dry my legs are and you can see the marks that they stretch. Is the focus focusing? Are around here. So I've got visible stretch marks around here. And yeah, and my skin is just generally quite ashy. Um, I've been using it every single day, um, sometimes twice a day because it gets uh, really hot in Nairobi. At the moment, we're in summer. So I've been using this sometimes twice a day. And I honestly, as a lotion, I really love it because it, it doesn't, I'm a sort of person who, to be honest, I don't like the feeling of lotion. It, like, like not lotion, but like, like oil, for example, like jelly, petroleum jelly. No, it's not for me. I can't. I, like, I ma it makes me feel like a slug. So I like that this, like when you put it on your skin, it's not like floating on your skin. It's like, gets into your skin and it's just like, it's like a wave, like a dolphin. Like it just like, it becomes like one with your skin. So you don't feel like a slug. Um, I don't feel like a slug. Very good at marketing. Um, so the thing, I mean, everybody has stretch marks. Some people don't, some people do, but stretch marks are beautiful. Um, some people like to hide them, some people don't like to hide them. For those that want to hide them, let's test it out. For those who are okay with them, we can also test it out. But even if this is not necessarily just with stretch marks, it's it's just like it's just like a nice lotion. And I honestly I like the smell of this. But it just mm, it smells almost like. I feel like it has like a, I don't know how to explain it, it's like a candy, but I can't explain the exact sort of candy. It's just something I would eat when I was younger. Maybe that's why I like the smell of it. But anyway, let's go to my knees. So the camera settings are exactly the same, though I think something that might be different is because, you know, the sun goes up and down, so the backlighting might be a little bit different. But anyway, let's take a good look at my knees. Before I begin, I'm gonna lotion this up a little bit. Okay, and then rub a dub dub and then we go in. Okay, so I'm gonna have to look at this on camera so I can see, but I think actually from looking at it, it does look like the marks have reduced a bit, but anyway, we can, I'll put the images side by side so we can just analyze and see. In the last video, I think I also at some point changed lenses um, so I could have a lens that's a little bit closer up. So I'm gonna change the lenses and we can see what if, the stretch marks did truly reduce. Reporting from my living room. Back to you, people of the internet. We're gonna put one leg, the leg from two weeks ago here, and the leg, the current leg here, and I'm gonna see um, what the differences are between the two legs. Uh, I'm only gonna look at this footage when I put it all on my computer, so I'm not gonna make like a judgment as of now, but you can just make a judgment for yourself depending on what you see my leg looks like. But yeah, I was just testing out this product to see what it's what it's like. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Bye!